Another day, another Uber. Racking up the Uber points. How you feeling today? Uh, not too bad. It's kind of cold out. Like I just probably should have brought a jacket. My nips are hard, so it's kind of <laughs> weird. But it's <laughs> just because you're nervous. Uh, Today is the day of the event. It's Friday. This is the qualifying day for tomorrow's event. As you can see over here, the skate park is unrecognizable. There are fences up around this whole place. It has been transformed into a full-on competition course, which is amazing. So we're going to go cruise on in there. We're going to get practicing. We're going to introduce everybody and check everything out. And we'll give you guys a scoop of the Vans BMX Pro Cup, the start of it. So uh, let's go check it out. So we're inside the skate park right now. And as you can see, it looks completely different than it did the last couple days we were here. They have the Vans logos all over the place. They have bleachers that they put here. There's a VIP area up here. And then over there is the announcing tower. So this is going to be pretty wild. Right now, the guys are going to get warmed up. They're going to do four heats today and they're going to figure out who's going on to tomorrow's event. Now today's event is the open qualifier. This is for everybody to try to have their chance to qualify for tomorrow's first event of the point series. Now the situation today is going to be 27 riders make it to the final. Top 20 make it to tomorrow's event. So we're going to see what happens. Vin, what heat are you in today? Heat 4. Heat 4, huh? You excited about this one? Yeah, dude. I feel good. I got a good night's sleep, good brekkie. Ready to go. Brekkie. Wow. I'm so Australian. You <laughs> apparently are. He <laughs> said brekkie. That's what all Australian people refer to breakfast as. So, uh, yeah, Vinny's full on. He's a local at this point. Whoa, Brandon Lupo is slipping and falling. That was awesome. So, Matty needs to work on a couple things. He wants to do the wall ride on the fence, and he's a little nervous about it because he's never wall ride a fence before. So, there's a couple things that he needs to work out in this one. This is Matt's first practice run of the day. Mr. Brandon Lupos. Yeah. How are you feeling today? Feeling good. I'm so stoked that this event's at like pretty much my home park. So it's cool to ride with all my friends from around the world that grew up riding. It's pretty crazy. How long have you been coming to this park? I started riding here when I was yeah, 12 or 13. So it's uh, pretty gnarly to like. I've always wanted to be a professional BMX rider and to ride at a pro event at my home park is gnarly. Well, so, have some fun excited. today, bro. Thank you so much. Brandon's one of the best Australian riders right now. It's amazing to see him ride this course. He's about to do a crazy big flare in his quarter pipe, so let's check it out. All right, here we go. Woo my god, that was huge. Yeah, look close. Alright, Matt's back in run number two of practice right here. He's got to fix that air. Three. Good solid airs right now. Maddie's gonna get a photo real quick with Vance photographer Colin McKay. Colin McKay is an Australian BMX rider. I looked up to a lot when I was younger, so he's going to be doing a suicide no hand over the spine. Let's see how it goes. Ooh, that was really good. Cool. You came a little closer than I thought. Good work there, Matt. Where did you get that shirt from? Show. <laughs> That's amazing. It blows my mind the amount of people that represent our channel and support our channel from all around the world. We love meeting everybody that comes up to us and tells us that they watch the videos and seeing the guy with my shirt on is amazing. So thanks a lot guys. Alright guys, we have a very special guest we're about to bring into the contest area. Pretty excited about this one and uh, I think you guys will be as well. So uh, let's grab him real quick. What a trooper. What a trooper. How are you, How are you feeling, man? I'm feeling good, yeah. First day up. Come on, we got you coming on in, man. You are in. No, I wasn't missing out. So great having Cameron here. Dude, we were so bummed out about your crash. But just seeing you back up on your feet, man, it's, it's amazing. So are you excited about this event or what? Man, I'm pumped. That's why I'm here straight away. First day out, I'm coming in. Give up our world tour in style. So one more time, we have any BMX fans in the house. 
All right, so we just started the event. There's going to be five heats of riders. There's 10 riders in each heat. Vinny is going to be in heat number four, and Maddie's in heat number two. We're gonna film some of the best riders, some of the fun things that are going on, and we will let you guys check it all out. Next up is gonna be Andy Buckworth. He's an Australian rider I've known for years. He's got some wild riding, so let's see what he does. Yeah, Andy Buckworth. Vinny, what do you think of Andy Buckworth? <laughs> Come on, Cindy Lady, here we go! Woo! Yes! That was awesome. Oh, that means that we should put our hands together. We can see the local boy. This is Brandon Lupos. Yeah! Oh. <laughs> first jump right there. He immediately lost his lean on that one. He looked like he went for a tire grab, but he like kind of slapped the thing. He went way off balance, so I think nerves got him a little bit, but he's got two runs to get into the top 27, and then they go into finals, so uh, let's see how run number two does for him. What do you think of Maddie's run? He's killing it. See how high boosted out of that? It's crazy. That means the tall water rider coming on in. Revin Vance, also his brother Sky Kramer. This is Matt Kramer. Boom! Wow, that was high. Uh, we'll put an extra one with him, Matt Kramer. Only 11 years old. Yes! Yeah, you're getting up close and close yeah, all your fans out there. Nice, the rock and pocket him. Looks like he got the nerves out of himself and he was able to deliver an awesome run. Even up that one, I saw he did the toboggan in the pocket there and he also did nothing over the spine, which is really cool. So let's see if it's enough to make it in the finals. But next up, we're going to have Vinny Menino going. Cam, do you approve of Maddie last run? I do, man. That pocket air was beautiful. Beautiful work. What happened on the first hit? I was coming in on an angle and I was just like, well, do what you can. So as soon as I took my hand off, I was like, oh, we're getting weird here. First hit. That's not good. Second run was good, though. Second run was dialed. Good job on that one. Happy about that. Let's see if it's enough. Cam approves. So I have very unique footage of the most famous BMX rider in the world about to leave a port john This is going to be pretty epic. There he is in all his glory. Great work, Steve. Crowd loves you. Behave yourself. <laughs> BMX wouldn't be what it is right now if it wasn't for Steve Crandall. Everybody loves Steve, so awesome to have him out here in Australia announcing today. All right, so I walked away from the course real quick to go meet somebody I saw wearing a Stan with Scotty shirt, and here he is. What's your name, big guy? Lee. How long have you been riding bikes for? Five years. That's awesome, yeah. man. So tell me about your bike. What do you got here? Sunday. Just complete except the bars. What's your favorite part about the bike? Bars. Yeah. Look at the handlebars. He's got my signature handlebars on there. Man, that looks so cool. And thank you for buying the shirt, man. That is so awesome. All right, Vinny's about to be dropping in. He's going for his first run. Let's see how this one goes. From Howell, New Jersey. Let's put it together for Vinny Barbarino. Vinny Barbarino! Welcome back. Come on, Big Ben. Yeah, Vinny. Beautiful 
Double talk. First run. So when I went to pick three with, I felt my wheel flip the cone thing before I took off. So I tried to salvage it. Oh wow! That's not a good feeling. Did you hurt anything? No. I mean, my head's a little shaky, but we're good. Thank God I had a certified helmet on. Yeah. Second run was great though. Felt good. I just flare was awesome. I don't know if it's gonna be enough to get me in, but we're gonna find out. Number ten, Mike Hunger Clark. In the top nine, we've got Shane Ellis. Number eight, Kurt Perkins. Seven, Ben Piggott. Number six, Andre Skatica. Fifth place qualifier, Maddie Kramer. Oh, yeah, Number four, Paul Tolan. Number three, Brandon Lupos. Top two, we got Cody Pollard. And our first place qualifier, Ryan Seville. Let's hear it, man. Those two right there, We're top two. Qualified in fifth place. What are you going to change in your run to get into the top three? Well, Scott, I don't really have much to change, so this is going to be quite the problem here. We're going to need more height. Yeah? We're going to need a big three no-hander over the spine. Okay. You better extend that nothing. And we're not going to do what we did in the first run over the first hip. Sound good? That would be funny. Definitely not would be funny. Not funny at all. I'll still laugh about it. <laughs> <laughs> that was my first reaction. I don't know. I guess I uh, just tried the same thing and just try and do it way better and way higher. All right. We'll, we'll really see what happens. That, so. That's all we can do is see what happens. So, so Vinny didn't qualify further from that after that crash that he had. But what it comes down to, Vinny is A-OK. -okay. He's not hurt at all. He ended up hitting his head pretty good with the helmet, but he's in good shape right now. So that is a win. And uh, we're going to be heading into the finals right now, and we will be seeing who is going to be walking away on the top of this one to qualify into tomorrow's main event. So uh, let's Let's get this going. Well, this dog, Mike Hunter. Oh, oh, oh my God. God. Oh, out there like that, Mike Let's make some noise. Oh, my God. That was absolutely insane. Here we go, Mike Hunter Clark. Party time. Here we go, let's see what happens. Yeah, Lupo is flying those wings right there. Rockstar, Hyper, Snafu, BMS Mafia, Game Protection. Woo! One foot X, showing that he's got a big bag of tricks. Lupo loves five dog. Loves his bike, dedicated rider, travels the world, can't, can't step through. Aaron back at us. 
looking back. Sydney, come on, do we have any fans out here? Lupos! Yeah, yeah we do. Big flare. Lupos popping out. Cody Pollard dropping in. Come on! Up in the bleachers, I want to hear ya! Number two qualifier, Blast and Hughes talking in right there. Crushing Cody, big air right there. Looking to keep that speed flowing with the manual, full to bowl. Cody just pumping that flat bottom, showing that he's got a lot of speed as he transfers. Serious heat, grab the seat, bring it around, and George that spine transfer on the wall. Oh, the Tears from heaven right there, Aaron yeah. over the island. Pollard coming back. Brian Seville on deck. All right, coming on out. How about a big round of applause for your number one qualifier? This is Brian Seville. This guy. Never good. Second round winner. That was awesome. 180 bar, clean, highest flare I've ever seen you do in your life. Oh, good too. Like, it was awesome. Good job. We talked too. Yep. Everything was dialed. What is that move? What are you doing in the first place? It works better on the other side, I guess. <laughs> That's been my band's team manager for the last 14 years right there. He's the man. Thank you, Sydney. It's an honor to be here, and it's also an honor to call the top 10 riders. So when I call your name, please make your way up. Jerry, the bad boy batter, green jacket, orange hat, and the energy to match is going to be passing out some of this cash. So let's put our hands together. Coming in 10th place, E.C.E. Martinez. 
in the ninth place, Nathan Tias. Eighth place, Andres Gariga. Coming in in seventh place, Sydney. He's one of your own, Ben Piggott. Sixth place, Brendan Lupos. Fifth place, Maddie Kramer. Fourth place, Paul Thorin. Steve, if you would not mind announcing our third place finisher. Let's put it together for the diesel mechanic, Cody Powell! Yeah, baby! Yeah! Cody, come on down! Second place! Let's put it together for the wild maniac, Shane Ellis! All right, the moment of truth, Sydney, out here at Five Dock. It's been my pleasure to call the shots with Daryl Law. But the hero today is your own Ryan Sarrell! How's it going, Frank? Hey, what's going on? I've been held by like 50 people this weekend. <laughs> Just we're add him to the list. We're <laughs> taking a photo with the famous Frank right now. Yeah. He's the most famous dog in Australia. Here we go. It's holidays, bye, bye. <laughs> Frank's going to be on YouTube. <laughs> Alright guys, we are heading on out of here. We are closing up for the day. What an awesome event. A lot of you guys are watching. I want you guys to understand that this event is about presenting the type of riding that is in a purest form. They want to see guys that are able to ride the bull, go as fast as possible, as high as possible, and have intricate lines. This isn't a regular contest where the best tricks are going to win. So congratulations to the guys that move on to tomorrow. And I'm excited for tomorrow's event. It's going to be amazing. Huge shout out to Cam for making it back here. He loved it, he had such a good time, and I'm so glad he was able to come back. But we're heading out right now, get ready for the next video, it will be the main event. So until next time guys, remember to subscribe to the channel, and thanks for watching. Peace!